Then again, it's not like I have room to, you know, say that the quarian's fucked up. I mean, I'm the king of fucking up. <laughs> Uh, I still remember pressing that one particular button on that damn mothership, and then BOOM! No more Chicago. Or wherever the hell it hit. I'm just saying Chicago just to give myself a damn place to say it was hit. Although hopefully it was Detroit. Yeah. Nah. Nah, it wasn't matter. I didn't talk to Caden. Please don't be boring. What's up? Anything you need, Commander? Looking for personal input. Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? I've wasted enough of your time for now, Commander. We'll have time for personal debriefings later. You haven't wasted any... Okay, tactical appraisal? What's your opinion on the last mission? I don't see how we could have done things any better. At least not without getting to Eden Prime sooner. And we were on the scene faster than any other Alliance ship could have been. Okay, so you're just talking about Eden Prime still. Goodbye. We'll talk another time, Lieutenant. Commander? Jeez, LT, like, I, I came here looking for conversation. You just, meh. Now, I realize you've probably got things you've got to do on the ship. I mean... I don't know what it takes to run a damn spaceship. I clearly don't know. That's a damn thing I don't. Damn good thing I don't. I'll probably screw up. If anyone has to take over for Captain Anderson, I'm glad it's you. I'm not sure about having non-humans on our ship, though. They're on our side. We're all on the same team here, Presley. With all due respect, sir, that's what they said about Nihilus. Look how that turned out. Right. Um, aliens on the ship. Speak freely, Presley. I want to know if you have a problem with non-humans. It's not that, Commander. Humanity has always handled its own problems. Saren attacked one of our colonies. We should be the ones to stop it. We don't need their help. Never turn away help. Some people think asking for help is a sign of weakness. That's just being stupid and stubborn. No matter how strong you are, allies can make you stronger. I guess so. Maybe I'm just stuck in the old ways of thinking. But don't worry, Commander. This won't be a problem. Personal questions. How did you end up assigned to the Normandy? I signed up with the Alliance as a navigator right out of school, following in my grandfather's footsteps, I guess. My first posting was on the Agincourt. We were at Elysium kind of during the that? Stillian Blitz. A massive fleet of alien raiders hit the colony, trying to wipe it out. They had the numbers. But their ships were no match for an Alliance frigate. It was a slaughter. We couldn't even keep track of how many ships they lost. Jeez. Now you're here? How'd you end up on the Normandy? I got my officer's commission after Elysium. Must have made an impression on the right people. Captain asked for me when he was picking his crew. Hmm. All right, well, goodbye. Carry on, Presley. Yes, sir. Yay, Paragon. Sir. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and ask, what are you people doing? I mean, are we still in dock? Why? Uh, whatever. Sup, Joker? Commander, something you need? Actually, I wanted to talk to you. Hmm, ship status report. How's the Normandy performing? Is she everything they said she'd be? She's the best ship in the fleet. If you've got a pilot who knows how to handle her. Hmm. Balance isn't what you'd expect. Takes a while to get used to that oversized drive core we got stuffed in the back, and her power can sneak up on you if you're not careful. The Normandy's probably too much ship for your average Alliance pilot, Commander. Lucky for you, I'm anything but average. <laughs> and you're kind of cocky, but maybe you're being honest. I just want to talk. I like to know my crew. Mind if I ask you a few questions? <laughs> I can see where this is going. You did a background check on me, didn't you? Well, I'll tell you the same thing I told the captain. You want me as your pilot. I'm not good. I'm not even great. I am the best damn helmsman in the Alliance fleet. Top of my class in flight school, I earned that. All those commendations in my file, I earned every single one. Those weren't given to me as charity for my disease. I uh, didn't mean to insult you. I'm sorry, Joker. I didn't even know you were sick. You mean... You mean you didn't know? Oh, crap. 
Hmm. Okay, I've got Vrolix syndrome, brittle bone disease. The bones in my legs never develop properly. They're basically hollow, too much force, and they'll shatter. Even with crutches and my leg braces, it's hard to get around. One wrong step and crack! It's very dramatic. Hmm. I've learned to manage Jeez. my condition, Commander. Put the Normandy in my hands and I'll make her dance for you. Just don't ask me to get up and dance unless, you know, you like the sound of snapping shin bones. Hmm. Well... Mind tell me about your disease. I need to know more about this Brolic syndrome if I'm putting my ship in your hands. Yeah, of course you do. It's an extremely rare condition. Nobody knows exactly what causes it. Genetic, maybe. It's treatable, but there's no cure. They classify my case as moderate to severe. I was born with over a dozen fractures. Hip, thighs, ankles. My bones were already broken. God! A hundred years ago, I wouldn't have survived past my first year. Lucky for me, modern medical science has turned me into a productive member of society. How do you do your job? You're not gonna break a bone trying to fly the ship, are you? Uh, I don't fly with my feet, Commander. So I'm fine as long as I'm in this chair. I gotta be real careful when I get up to take a piss, though. Hmm. I can do my job as well as anyone on the ship. Better, actually. So don't worry about it. Alright, let's change topics. I'm not trying to make you uncomfortable. Let's talk about something else. Whatever you want, Commander. How did you get your nickname? Why does everyone call you Joker? It's a lot shorter than saying Alliance Flight Lieutenant Jeff Moreau. Plus, I love to make little children laugh. Yeah, right. I was just thinking how much you remind me of Santa Claus. <laughs> Look, I didn't pick the name. One of the instructors in flight school used to bug me about never smiling. She started calling me Joker, mm, and it stuck. Were you unhappy? Why didn't you ever smile? Hey, I worked my ass off in flight school, Commander. The world's not gonna hand you anything if you go around grinning like an idiot. By the end of the year, I was the best pilot in the academy. Even better than the instructors, and everybody knew it. They'd all got their asses kicked by the sickly kid with the creaky little legs. One guess who was smiling at graduation. Hmm. All right, well, goodbye. I have to go. All right, see ya. No, as long as you get anything else to say. Let's see. I'm not talking in circles with you, Joker. You're cool, but I'm not talking in circles with you. Okay. Another codex. Joy. Now oh, then. Whoa. Thirteen point two million people live on the damn citadel, not including the keepers. And it would it it weighs seven point eleven billion metric tons. Okay, yeah, that's not that's not just ridiculously over. Oh my goodness! All right, zooming out, zooming out. Okay. What the hell is asteroid X fifty seven? What's Pinnacle Station? Uh, whatever. God, there's a lot of places I can explore, huh? Well, I'll go to Yara's dig site in the Artemis Tau. Ah, shit, I'm gonna have to look for it, aren't I? Well, to Sparta! Piss myself this time. Hmm. Now, if I were a... Alright, guess I'll go to planet to planet. Oh, that's cool. Actually, has information about the planets inside. Survey. Gas deposit survey scans from orbit have detected a large concentration of hydrogen. Do what? Oh, I got paid? Oh my. Alright, I need to know. Maintain fleets and continue experiencing the Alliance. Must find new resources whenever can. You recently surveyed an important deposit and claimed it for the Alliance. There must be more like them in the Traverse. 
I gotta find six gases, 20 rare earths, 20 light metals, and 20 heavy metals? Yeah! Okay, okay. Explore the uncharted worlds of the Artemis Tau cluster to find the Arch of Sony. Okay. Oh boy. signal from the planet's surface it looks like an automated distress beacon really hmm. well if it's a distress beacon let's go check it out hmm I think I'll take Ashley and Garrus. Yeah. Oh god, 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 oh Okay! That scared the shit out of me. At least I get to drive this thing, finally. Oh. Well, I'm not gonna claim you handle like a dream. Okay, time to use something I've never done before. Alright. Uh, what happened to your... Okay. <laughs> Let's get your soldier skills up. Assault rifle up. Combat armor and assault training and one into your fitness. And you're already... Yeah, okay. Damn, what happened to mine? Alright. Whoa. Whoop. Distress signal, an anomaly, and debris. So I can explore this whole square of... Alright, well, the distress signal is just right at the head. I need for me to set a waypoint. Oh, God. I know I said I wanted to drive this thing, but now I'm starting to regret it. Uh, it bounces around like crazy. Away time! Oh, damn it! Ah! Quit flipping me! I can't flip it! I used it! Repair, damn you! Oh god, come on! Go! Shit! We're gonna die! Getting out of here! Retreat! Retreat! Gain some ground! Oh my god, we are smoking! We are on fire! What the fuck was that?! Get to repairing! God almighty! Jeez, our repair must suck! I would try and take that thing on foot, but I'm not suicidal. It flipped me like a dozen damn times. There's no way in hell I could have handled it. Just, uh, just keep trying to repair her. Okay. I think that's good enough structural 
integrity to try and kill this damn thing. I just gotta be smarter with how I drive. Yeah, me smart drive. Uh, that's a sentence that doesn't work. Alright, now get away from any where it can pop up. There we go. Suck it! Shit. Got where to go. Oh god! Die! I'm shooting you with a 155 millimeter cannon! You should be living! Did I kill it? Oh my god, I think I actually killed it. <gasps> well. Fuck this day. Aligned soldiers. Looks like they were lured here by the distress beacon. Well, can we shoot this thing? These are Admiral Kahoka's men. We need to tell him what happened here. Admiral who's? Look, we're lucky to be alive. Screw this distress beacon. You hear me? Screw it! They just nearly lured us to our doom. Now, before I go back to the Normandy, there are other things to check out, so I might as well. Oh my god! I never want to see one of those things again. It was called a Thresher Maw, right? Isn't that what happened on my stinking mission? Like, those things showed up and, like, wiped everyone out? Except for me? If so, like, I'm a beast. In fact, let me check that. Codex. Personal history. Thresher Maws, yeah. And, uh... Let's see. After, Thresher Maws are subterranean carnivores that spend their entire lives eating, or searching for something to eat. Jesus. Threshers reproduce via spores that can lie dormant for millennia, yet are robust enough to survive prolonged periods in deep space and atmospheric re-entry. You're shitting me. As a result, Thresher spores appear on many worlds, spread by previous generations of space travelers. The body of a thresher never entirely leaves the ground. Only the head and tentacles erupt from the earth to attack. In addition to physical attacks, threshers have the ability to project toxic chemicals and emit bursts of infrasound as a shockwave weapon. The Alliance first encountered threshers on the colony of Akuz in 2177. After contact was lost with the pioneer team, Marine units were deployed to investigate. The shore parties were set upon by hungry threshers, and nearly the entire assault force was killed. Alliance forces recommend engaging threshers with vehicle-mounted heavy weapons. Yeah, that's the plan, and wow, it actually talked about the mission of the coups that I was a part of. Joy. Gah. Oh, oh, shit! Ah! Yeah, like, I need to freaking stress test this thing anymore. What the hell? Redeploy. A mummified solarian? Found Captain Rowan's identification tag, however, it ends up... I mean, it ends up here is possible now for sure. Okay. Now there's some debris here. God, as long as I don't run into another thresher, I think I'll be fine. Couldn't I just call the Normandy in for like an airstrike or something? That'd be nice. I mean, it's got to have weapons. There's no way in hell it's just, you know, stealthy and that's it friggin' ship, a military ship without weapons is the dumbest thing I think I could ever hear of. Oh 
Uh, my throat hurts from all my screaming. Get back to the ship, I'm gonna need some water. Electronic skill too. Well, I guess we're leaving. Wait, what the hell is that? I see you on my map. Come on, Mako, you can do it. Oh, I see something. I'm coming for you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh shit! Ah! ah, 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 ah. That somehow worked out. A mineral deposit, all right. Light me metals surveyed. Yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. Holy shit.